suppressor mutation suppressor mutations are those mutations that suppress the effect of an other mutation usually in this case there are two mutations one mutation at one point while the second mutation is present on another point one of the mutation suppresses the effect of the other mutation if there is such a phenomena it is called as suppressor mutation organisms which have suppressor mutations they have two mutations one mutation is present at one point while the second mutation is present on a second point so those organisms they are called as double mutants suppressor mutation is different different from the reverse mutation in case of reverse mutation the same mutation is reverted back while in case of suppressor mutation the mutation is present on an different location genetic suppression is a phenomena that restores the phenotype seen prior to the original background mutation suppressor mutation is usually useful in studying the phenomena which are present in the in the cell those phenomena they are called as biological phenomena so with the help of suppressor mutation we can study the effects of the mutations on the biological phenomena intragenic suppression intragenic suppression are those mutations if two mutations they are present within a single gene then such a phenomena is called as intragenic suppression while on the other hand intergenic suppression is a phenomena if there are two mutations and one mutation is present in one gene while the second mutation is present in an other gene if two mutations they are present in two different genes then that is called as intergenic suppression suppressor mutation conclude suppressor mutations are those mutations that suppresses the effect of one mutation they can be in the form of intragenic or within the same gene they can be in the form of intergenic two mutation in two different genes